Hey Jay Warriors, many of you are asking sir, can you give us a clear cut idea about the Mars versus percentile? Uh, see there is a lot of uh, debate, a lot of discrepancy as to how these marks are so high for such a percentile, how come the cutoffs are so high and all those things are there. Uh, that is another topic. See whatever has happened has happened and I know we have to move on, we will also fight for it simultaneously. Uh, as we fight for your marks, as we fight for your percentiles, it's also important that we do not lose time in analyzing and also preparing for the second attempt. So I hope you agree with me. Now there are two news things, articles which I need to tell you about. So first thing is regarding the declaration of NTS course which has been now made official on the NTA website. Now, this is the first thing and the second thing is this one, your main thing, the PDF that you are looking for, the link is there down in the description box as you are watching this video. In case you want to see where it is, I'll just show that to you and then I will uh, go through this data points. Okay, so as you are watching this particular video, you can see there are two links. One is for 90 percentiles and one is for 99 percentile and above. So this is from 90, 91, 92 like that. This is for 99 percentile and above. So both the links are there. You can click on the link. You can enter your name, whatever, and you can uh, download it for free, of course, of course. Now, I'll tell you what is so special about these data points. Look at this. 99 percentile, 27th January shift 1, 236, 211, 203, 212, 193, 191, 170, 151, 161, 172. So, how is it that the score is reducing? How is it that the score is reducing for the same 99 percentile? Did the paper become easy? Did the students uh, become, uh, you know, little bit like less average students attempted the paper? That is something really, really interesting to note. See, there are many factors which would have played this downtrend. If you see, 230s, 211, 212, and then 190s, 170, and then goes to 161, 151 also. Why has the marks reduced for the same percentile? Most likely, it has happened that, most likely it has happened that, there were many students who were there in the first 2-3 days. That's what we are getting, the reports as of now. Many students were there in the first few days. Few students have attempted in the last few days. That is not your fault, 100%. That is the way, you know, the examination was conducted or the seats or the allocation had happened, number one. Number two, it, it usually is probably, or you know, it can happen that most of the good students or most of the higher ranked students have attempted the paper in the first two, three days and the less ranked students have attempted in the last few days. But it is very strange for me to accept that fact because how does NTA even know who is um, a topper, who is an average, how, who is a below average student, right? So that is very strange. But by coincidence, like, you know, in maths, you have probabilities of every event which can happen, right? It's not necessary every time everything gets balanced out. Sometimes all the things just happens by coincidence. So maybe by coincidence, the above average students were present in the first few shifts. That's why the percentiles are very difficult to get in the first few shifts. You can see the scores are very high. You can see 97 percentile is at 196, 170, 165, 174, 152. 134. This goes as low as 118, 126, 131 in the last few days, in the last few shifts. If you go down, if you go down to, you know, 90, 91 percentile, it is in the range of 140s, 120s and even goes to 102 to 8176. Now, the real question is, will the cutoff be at 90? Will it be at 91? Will it be at 89? That is something which we need to see. We have to wait and watch as and when we get more and more information about this. This is from 90 to 91. A similar data I have for 99 and above, this is even more critical. This is like, guys, let me tell you one thing. 
uh, from morning ever since uh, first of all i conducted the class till almost 12 30 yesterday right and then i slept and uh, i woke up i didn't even have bath i just had breakfast and from morning we are just collecting data we are just making slides we are just making these uh, sessions uh, you know we are making i am only making all the thumbnails most of the times i am only making the session i am only going live so guys it's a lot of hard work i have not eaten much since morning so please 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 at least support the channel and i mean we are for all the students out here so please support it okay by smashing the like button and also subscribing to the channel it means a lot it means a lot really and i'm doing it for nothing i'm just coming over here to give you information because i want all my students to be well informed look at this 99.9 percentile is at 278 marks 278 marks in shift one can you imagine okay and then it goes all the way up to 250 224 just imagine this 31st january shift to two person 215 marks okay just see this this is very interesting 215 marks and you would have got 99.9 percentile you would have got 99.9 percentile what is your say on this 215 marks and the same thing if you go here okay, if you go here like look at this the same 27 january shift one for 230 marks you get 99 percentile not 99.9 so 99.9 and just 215 marks and you know this is very very uh interesting or i would say shocking trend i mean very disappointing i personally feel and i have been saying that even in the previous videos please tell me if you resonate with me please tell me if you agree with me i feel that there should be only one single shift just like how many other exams are and everybody writes the paper on the same day then after a few months you have the next attempt and if you want take a third attempt do you agree with me or not just put up a heart and if you are watching this recorded after the lecture is going then please let me know okay so also let me tell you over here that nta has officially released the pdf the press release of how many students attempted how many students were there in all the categories and who are the toppers of every single day just have a look at it yes you can see it right over here you can see it right over here all the categories all the uh, yes all the categories everything is there over here for both the papers and the state toppers are also mentioned along with the total toppers of 100 percentile 100 percentile score was obtained by 23 students 23 students have got 100 percentile my dear warriors this is crazy 100 percentile 100 percentile was obtained by you know uh, so many students this is crazy and look at this state wise toppers also 100 percentile 98 percentile 99 percentile so many students are there with very very good scores so it tells you that the paper was very very easy the paper was very easy that's why the percentiles went down now what is the best solution to this what is the best solution to this i feel the best solution to this is please let's request nta please make the paper hard only for physics at least moderate or at least chemistry not everything at least one subject apart from maths you make it little bit challenging and if you feel that you agree with me as you are watching this particular video please fill up this form right over here please fill up this form to raise your voice and concern with nta are you happy with the scores are you uh, okay you just need to enter your details just fill up this form down here you can also get the entire PDF of 90 and 99 percentile right over here. Okay, so you can get it completely uh, for free of cost after login, right? Please do that. So if you feel that at least one more subject should be moderate, please raise your concern. And I feel maths difficulty can go down a little bit, not too much. Yes, maths is the most important subject for engineering. You can't make it very easy. Let maths remain almost the same level or a little bit uh, easier, but other two subjects i feel should be made at least moderate it should be fun to solve it should be little bit challenging or else these things can happen 
Second solution is there should be one single shift where all the people write the exam on the same day so that this comparison does not happen. If you agree with me, if you agree with me, let me know. If you agree with me, let me know. Please fill up the form. Please fill up the form if you agree with me and also comment and share this video so that more and more students show that more and more students show support for this because I don't want our juniors to suffer. I don't want the next batch students to go through the same thing what you guys went through. Whatever has happened has happened now. You cannot sit and cry. Uh, if you want to cry, please cry only today, not after that because we have to restart. We have to get back into our zone of full-fledged war-like preparation because there is not much time to waste. See, whatever disappointment, whatever frustration is there, okay, remove it all today. You want to get angry, fine, get angry. You want to cry, you cry. But after that, please don't sit and cry. Please don't get angry because you will have to focus on J advance, J main, second attempt, board exams and other such exams. So let's get back to studies, okay? So this was a very important data that I wanted to share with all of you. So God bless you all. Take care. Bye-bye. Hasta luego, Captain Shreyas, signing off. Thank you for liking.